Title, The Egyptians' Resistance to Fraser's Campaign, How They Fought Back and Prevailed Introduction In the early 19th century, the British Empire was expanding its reach across the globe, and Egypt was no exception. In 1801, a British army led by General Sir Ralph Abercrombie defeated the French troops in Egypt and took control of the country. However, the British occupation of Egypt was not without its challenges, as the Egyptians fought back against the British forces. One notable instance of Egyptian resistance was during Fraser's campaign in 1807. In this article, we will explore the Egyptians' resistance to Fraser's campaign, the most important areas in which clashes took place, and how the Egyptians got rid of Fraser's campaign. The Clashes in Tarfa Fraser's campaign was launched in 1807 to quell the resistance of the Egyptians who were unhappy with the British occupation of their country. The campaign was led by Major General John Fraser, who had previously served in India and was known for his harsh tactics. The campaign was centered around the town of Tarfa, where the Egyptians had gathered to resist the British forces. The clashes in Tarfa were intense, with the Egyptians using guerrilla tactics to fight the British forces. The town was surrounded by a network of canals, which the Egyptians used to their advantage by launching surprise attacks on the British troops. The British forces were forced to retreat to a nearby fort, where they were besieged by the Egyptians. The Egyptians' Victory Despite the British forces' superior firepower and training, the Egyptians fought back with determination and bravery. They were able to cut off the British forces' supply lines, forcing them to surrender after a week-long siege. The British forces suffered heavy casualties, with over 500 soldiers killed or wounded. The Egyptians' victory at Tarfa was a significant blow to the British occupation of Egypt. It showed that the Egyptians were not willing to accept foreign rule and were willing to fight for their independence. The victory also inspired other Egyptians to join the resistance movement against the British forces. The Suffering of the Egyptians The Egyptians' resistance to the British occupation of their country was not without its costs. The British forces responded to the resistance with harsh measures, including the destruction of villages and the killing of civilians. The Egyptians also suffered from famine and disease, as the British forces disrupted the country's food supply and sanitation systems. Conclusion The Egyptians' resistance to Fraser's campaign was a significant moment in the country's history. It showed that the Egyptians were willing to fight back against foreign rule and inspired others to join the resistance movement. The victory at Tarfa was a significant blow to the British occupation of Egypt and demonstrated the Egyptians' determination and bravery. However, the resistance was not without its costs, as the Egyptians suffered from harsh measures and the disruption of their daily lives.